Now, today I'm going to prepare for you kangumu, crunchy kangumu. Now, what do I need? I need flour. It's here. I have salt. I have uh, color, food color. And I have marandazi with me, baking powder that is. I have blue band. I have chipsy that is some solid oil. I have liquid oil. I have some warm water here, milk with me, sugar. And the cup that will help me to change over. Why do I have everything here? I have everything here so that I can avoid running up and down. My oil is even ready here. I've just already melted it so that I do not disturb myself a lot. So I'm going to begin mixing. As you know, we need um, flour. So I'm going to just get out of it. And this is, I'm targeting three cups because of the quantity of cocoa we are going to use. I have uh, about three adults and uh, three kids. So that's why I'm using three. I know that will be enough for us. So once I have the three with me, I have now to ensure that I put in my baking powder. I put in my baking powder here. Uh, normally I have to use a spoon in getting the right quantities so I have so here baking powder with me I just place one whole spoon and I know that will be okay and why are you using baking powder? baking powder is there to ensure that my um, my pancakes not really my pancakes but my cakes will have to be soft then I'm going to add Blue band. Blue band is there to make it soft and uh, tasty. So I just need two spoons. That is enough. Now once I've picked that, I have to place a pinch of salt. Because if you place too much, you won't like the taste. The pinch is enough. After that, I need sugar. Now sugar we need a lot, so I put half a cup, because I don't like very sugary, some may put even three quarters of a cup, but for me, I don't want it to be sugary. Now solid oil, I can't use it now, I'll be using the final ends. Now food color, so that it gives us the, a, a better outcome of the coloring for the just place a pinch then after that i have already my solid stuff i kind of mix a bit so i will ensure that i mix until they are one so that we don't have part of our flour being uh, having all that I put in when the rest doesn't have it has to be mixed properly then now I can place my milk why are you putting milk milk is there as a liquid that has to ensure that this one will be you know it will become dark so we are preparing our dark and will you put a, a, some water or possibly if you don't have milk you use water or if my milk will not produce the kind of uh, dark that i need then i may add up some water but okay. for now let me use my milk and see how far it will take me you know milk has a way to make cakes uh, taste well you know it all these short cakes that is why you're hearing me using cake at some point, I'm just saying Kangumu, the normal name that Kenyans know. Okay. Can you see the color? Yeah. Yeah, that's the work of food color. As you can see my milk is doing it. I may not actually need that water if it mixes well. Wow, wow. 
so you make, make sure you mix quite well so that everything is everywhere and remember it has to be a bit tough it shouldn't be like that of uh, mandas because shortcakes need some kind of hard stuff not as soft as that for mandas So you have said that fly is enough? Yeah, I think for my family with uh, three adults, three kids, that is enough. You know, I just do this for family. I'm not in business, so I don't have to prepare so much. I'll transfer this to that. And who taught you to do this? I learned from... Uh, you know, a friend, she was doing business and I was interested in knowing this because sometimes you don't have to keep buying everything with the economy itself. I leave it a bit, but it doesn't have to settle. I'm just going to leave it a bit. Like how many minutes? Oh, this one is just about four minutes and then I want just to ensure that my oil is proper. Then I can start. The next procedure, as you can see, we are going to ensure that we make our, our pieces. So I'm placing my duff here. And why have you made a big duff? Uh, you know, the half cakes need a thicker part, at least two centimeters or three. So that is why I have to make it a bit thick than uh, the chapati. So I don't know. And I placed that, uh, you saw me placing some club. Yep. Yeah, that was to ensure that it doesn't stick on my rolling board. Okay. Now you have to cut it to the shapes you would wish. Most times for kangumu we like the rectangle shapes. So I'm going to cut. 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 Yeah. How many times do you cut? Cut three um, because now my pan, um, my board is not as big. Once I have this, I again cut it now. Each of them, each of them, each sizable, sizable allow us to put it into all. and remove, ensure that it just has the right shape. Now, you can see my own here, as I told you. If you don't waste time, you make it ready. So, just put it in and it begins to boil. Put it in and uh, just I think four are enough for me here, so that the oil is enough. Then once they are risen, you can see they are rising. Eh? Yes. So once they rise like this, then you turn so that the other side also rises. Eh? You turn. You turn. So you don't have to be buying, you know, escort every now and then. You just prepare in the evening and in the morning as people are going for work, you have something ready for the family. And this one is a bit better because it's enough for the family. And uh, you have you not used a lot to buy whatever you need. Are you seeing the color turn? Yes. Yeah. So brown. Yeah, they are turning into brown. And it's just through observation that you know it's ready. Yeah, so. 
just want you to observe. Can you see them cracking? That's what causes the crunch. You see this part? That what tells you. That tells you we prepared it well. Even when okay. we are preparing our dab, the mixtures, we did the right quantities. That's why it's looking like that. Within a short time, it's done. You can be sure that this one is. Now are ready. They are ready. You can see they are turning. If you leave it for more than this, they'll become black, and that will not be good for the family. So at this level, you can begin removing. You can see that. Yep. Let's move. So you just keep doing that process. You just keep doing that. And if you prepared earlier again, it saves you from wasting oil. You know, oil is expensive these days. You can't waste oil if you prepared. You set everything in place before then. Yeah, so that is my. You can see my crunchy wow. pancakes. How do you like it? They are so de they look delicious. Oh yeah, I will give, give it to uh, my. You can see even from inside. Yeah, so you can taste and tell me the product. Okay, thank you. Subscribe.